Randy here from Restream. And in this video, I'm gonna show you exactly how you can dramatically increase the quality of your stream without rushing out to buy a new webcam. And we'll do that by tuning our video lighting. So let's get right into it. In this video, we're gonna cover three lighting systems. The first lighting system consists of a single light placed behind your webcam, either a ring or a panel light like I'm using. The second lighting system is a two-point lighting system, which consists of two key lights or a key and a fill light placed on the opposite angle of your webcam from each other. The third lighting system is exactly like a two-point lighting system. The only difference is it adds a backlight behind the subject to kind of make them pop out from the background. There are a ton of different lights on the market that you can choose from. Overhead lights, backlights, key lights, ring lights, even the sun itself. And it's with that in mind that we surveyed our audience to find out what the best lighting system is. As you can see, it's almost evenly split. And that's because video lighting is a highly individual process. What theme, brand, or look you're going for, and even the mood you're trying to set, will all come across in how you light yourself. Using a single point ring light will give you a dramatic look while using a two-point lighting system will give you a more interview look, and a three-point lighting system gives you the most versatility for how you wanna look on your stream and where those shadows are or aren't. Single-point lighting is achieved by placing a key or ring light directly behind your webcam. When you're using this lighting system, I highly suggest you use a ring or key light that you can change the brightness of. That way your eyes aren't being strained you won't be washed out, and you'll have more control over the final look of your stream. It's with that in mind that I suggest the Elgato key lights. These are super simple to set up. You plug them in, download the Elgato Control Center app, and just like that, you're connected. Once you've done that, you'll be able to set it up behind your webcam and start playing with the brightness and color temperature until you get the look that you're going for. The second system that we're gonna talk about is the two-point lighting system. Remember, a two-point lighting system consists of either two key lights or a key and a fill light. Here's what I mean when I say that. When I turn off my fill light, you can see that the shadows get a bit darker, but overall the lighting of the scene hasn't changed. Now, when I turn off my key light, you see it's a bit more dramatic. And that's because your key light is what lights your face and casts the shadows, while your fill light fills in those shadows. Now, if you're looking to eliminate all of your shadows and have a more flat look, you may wanna have two key lights. But keep in mind, having shadows on your face is how we define contour. So without those shadows, you might come off looking a little 2D. When setting up your key light for the first time, you wanna look for this triangle here. This is called the Rembrandt patch and is a well-known photography term to kind of signify the best lighting. Once you have your key light set up, set your fill light opposite to that and turn it on at a lower brightness. I also have my fill light tuned to a bit more yellow to add some more color to my face. The final lighting system that we're gonna talk about is a three-point lighting system. Now, a three-point lighting system is exactly the same as a two-point lighting system. The only difference is an additional backlight, hair light, floor light, flood light, there's a bunch of terms for this light. But in essence, it's a light that sits behind you that shines on you to separate you from the background. You can see it creates this light glistening effect around the edge. And if I move out of the way, you can really see it. Its main purpose, as I said, is to separate you from the background. However, you can do this with RGB strips, key lights, LED lights, or even just turning on your overhead light. And that's it. We've covered the top three lighting systems that are currently used online today. From the single point lighting system to the two point lighting system, all the way to the three point lighting system. We also talked about why you might wanna choose one over the other and how it can set the overall mood of your show. Remember, buying new lights and setting them up is the fastest and easiest way you can upgrade the quality of your stream without having to purchase a new webcam. So let us know in the comments below if we missed your lighting system or if you have a custom lighting setup and what it is. Otherwise, I hope you enjoyed today's video. 
As always, I've been Randy from Restream and have a great stream.